In this video, we'll talk about the chain link, the link token, and the amazing news, link staking, which is coming very soon. So let's get right into it. First of all, welcome back to Selenix Crypto and welcome if you're new, I hope you're all doing great, uh, even in these market circumstances. Um, but for Link, it's actually looking, wow, quite sunny, quite, quite, quite bullish, not 100% unexpected. We were expecting some more bullish momentum, um, but obviously the, the bearish fundamentals in, in, in the entire market have kind of, uh, well, dimmed down our expectations, I think, for, for Chainlink. Um, the main thing is, and I want to start off with the fundamentals, is that uh, staking of Link is coming up. Very soon, I think uh, a select amount of indiv individuals were able to stake some link the 6th of December. Um, and you can all, all, all find this on, on, their, um, on their blog, which you can see right here, chaining staking and then blog.chain.link. You can see that uh, e Economics 2.0 staking protocol and staking v1 is launching. Um, blah, 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 all, all the technicals behind it and there was some sort of, I mean, there were dates, right? Yeah, so, and, and then also December the 8th, everybody can stack an initial limit of 7,000 link per address um, with a, a initially limited 25 million link pool cap and other applicable uh, participation requirements. So, uh, you can actually start staking your link very soon and that's bullish for link because, uh, well, that adds value to the link token, just intrinsic value uh, that it adds. Because right now, I mean, the value of link is, uh, is, is, is not, that, not that much, but if you actually gain some uh, governance and, uh, and, and if you gain some value by keeping up the Chainlink network, that adds value to the token because Chainlink itself is a very valuable project. And it just needs to be linked with that token, which is happening right now. Uh, if we then, you can see, I mean, th this is very hypothetical, but if we then just zoom into the short term technicals of a link right now, um, given the fact that we know that the fundamentals for Chainlink specifically are bullish and for the market are neutral because the economic fundamentals in the market are actually quite good right now. What I expect is that we're at a major resistance level right now at 6.8. I expect us to break above that. Find resistance around 7, take a break, retest, get up to our next level at around 7.2 and 7.25. Now, what's probably going to happen is that we will be bullish until staking is activated. All right, we're not going to be bullish afterwards. It always happens with crypto like this. It's always bullish until an event, and then when it happens, we crash down. So it's the question how high we can get. Um, I think we can also still break through 7.2 and 7.25 and get up to 7.6 and 7.7, uh, after which I will make another update um, on, on if we can get even higher than that. I mean, I think it's realistic that we could even get higher than that ahead of everything that happened with FTX. Uh, we were getting towards $9. The, um, I think everything that happened with FTX did kind of uh, destroy hopes of getting like t to $10. Um, but I do think we can get higher. And obviously, something I must say is that, uh, is, is that you know, it might not happen this quickly. We might have to consolidate on top of 6.75 for a couple of days before we're able to break through 7.2. Um, could also be that we do it very quickly. Uh, like this break above $6.8, I am expecting fairly quickly. Like um, at, at, the very, at the very most in the next two days. So, but yeah, ov overall pretty bullish on link. Uh, but that's my analysis and my take uh, and, and some fundamental insights on the chain link for now. If you do have any questions, let me know down in the comments. But for now, take care and bye.